and bow. All right. Um, this week we're focusing on one-step self-defenses. Um, we're going to work on getting ourselves ready for them. And I want to focus on the mobility aspects of the self-defenses. All right. To help us all. Uh, and so that we can help the other students. So in th this being the general class, we're going to work on our beginner ones, as well as our one-step self-defense against the roundhouse or haymaker punch. So let's focus a little bit on our mobility. All right. Uh, arms out. Okay. Let's start off with some arm circles. Okay. Going forward, getting bigger. Try not to hit the ceiling. Okay, other direction. Good. All right. Keep those arms out there. And let's do a twist all the way to one side. And on the next count, all the way to the other side. Ish. Ni. San. Chi. Go. Rook. Sich, hach, pu, ju. Okay, very good. All right, uh, let's loosen up that neck some up and down. Ish, ni, san, chi, go, rook, sich, hach, pu, ju. Side to side. Ish, ni, san, chi, go, rook, sich, hach, pu, ju. And around. Ish. Ni, San, Chi, Go. Other direction. Ish, Ni, San, Chi, Go. Okay. All right. Hands behind the head. Knee lifts. Lift the knee to the elbow. Alternate on each count. Ish, Ni, San, Chi, Go. Rook. Sich, hach, ku, ju, ich, ni, san, chi, go, rook, sich, hach, ku, ju. Good. All right. Let's put our feet about shoulder width apart. Put your hands on your hips. All right. And we're going to kind of do the, the hula circle or... Uh, also better, probably better known as the munchback circle, okay? So we're gonna go around in one direction, making the biggest circle with our hips as we can, okay? All right, so let's go counterclockwise. Ish, ni, san, chi, go. And other direction. Ish, ni, san, chi, Go. Okay, good. All right, feet together, hands on the knees. All right, we're gonna bend our knees and dip to the right. Ish, ni, san, chi, go. Rook, sich, hach, ku, ju. Other side, ish, ni, san, chi, go. Rook, sich, hach, ku, ju. Okay, good. All right. Give yourself some room. I want you to step back with your right leg in the forward stance. All right. We're going to be executing our circle step, kind of exaggerating it. All right. Learning to drive our weight into it in that direction. At the same time, when we step, we're going to have our arms out and then we're going to twist once to each side. All right. We're going to do four going forward and four going backwards. All right. Here we go. Arms out. Each and twist. Knee and twist. San, twist, and chi, twist. 
twist. Now going backwards. Each. Knee. San. Chi. Okay, good. Shake that off. Okay, another one of the mobility exercises I gave you. I want your feet together, keep them together. All right. And what we're going to do, try to do this with your hands on your hips, but every time I count, you're going to jump forward and jump back. That's one rep. Okay, here we go. All right. Each. Ni, san, chi, go, rok, sich, hach, hu, ju. Good? Alright. Next rep, or next exercise. Go into the side. Go to the left, then back to the right. That's one rep. Alright. Keep the feet together. Alright. Here we go. Ish, ni. San, chi, go, rook, sich, hach, hu, ju. Okay. All right. Next exercise. We're going to start off short distance switching the feet. Okay. So, to start off, that's one rep. Okay, so each time it's a double. All right. Each. Ni. San. Chi. Go. Rook. Sich. Hach. Ku. Ju. Okay, good. All right. We're going to do each of those another set. And this time I want your jumps to be a little bit farther. Not a little bit farther every count, just a little bit farther than it was the last set. Okay, so first we'll do 10 forward and back. Okay, here we go. Each, ni, san, chi, go, rook, sich, hach, ku, ju. Okay, all right. Side to side, left and right. A little bit further. Each. Ni. San. Chi. Go. Rook. Sich. Hach. Ku. Ju. Good. All right. Now, one more time. Front and back. And let's try that. Each time a foot goes forward, we're coming down in our forward stance. All right. Here we go. Just waiting for Sensei Kyle there. All right. Forward and back. Each. Ni. San. Chi. Go. Rook. Sich. Hach. Gu. Ju. Good. All right. Now let's get into breaking down our one-step self-defenses probably the most difficult part of this for the students is basically doing the block as a reverse block all right boom reverse block instead of, they're all used to this okay but we don't necessarily practice them in the reverse form enough Okay, so what I want, let's just do our inside blocks. All right, I want a big step to the side and a reverse block. Okay, in this case, since everybody that's in this class already knows by Sedai, that's basically the movement you're making. Okay, boom. All right, so let's do it like that. Starting with the left, we'll go four forward. And then four back. Alright. Reverse block. Reverse inside block. Each. Knee. 
Son. Chi. And now backwards. Each. Knee. Son. Chi. Okay. All right. Face blocks. Each. Knee. Son. Chi. Backwards. Go. Roke. Switch. Hatch. Okay. Groin blocks. Each. Knee. Son. Chi. Backwards. Go. Rook. Switch. Hatch. Okay. All right. Shake that off. All right. So let's do the whole beginner self defenses. All right. And the next thing to concentrate on is after the block is grabbing. Okay? So the first one we're going to do is stomach punch. So it's inside block grab. All right? And I'm going to just make a little change here. Okay? Is that block, grab, pull. All right? I'll explain why after. Okay? So it's block, grab, pull. All right? So, hmm. let's do this stepping forward. All right? Left side, left first. Okay, here we go. Each step, block, grab, pull. Okay? All right? Knee, step, block, grab, pull. Okay. Son, step, block, grab, pull. Chi, step, block, grab, pull. Okay. And we'll do that going backwards. Okay. Step, block, grab, pull. Okay. Step, block, grab, pull. Step, block, grab, and pull. All right. Very good. All right. Let's move on to face block. So it's going to be stepping, face block, grabbing, pull. Okay. All right. Here we go. All right. Face block. Step, block, grab, pull. All right. Step, block, grab, pull. Step, block, grab, pull. Step, block, grab, pull. And going backwards. Step and block, grab and pull. 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 All right. Groin block. So it's going to be step, block, grab, pull. All right. Each, grab, pull. Knee, grab, pull. Okay. Time, block. Buck. All right, somehow I got screwed up. All right, and chi. All right, going backwards. Each. Me. Sun. Chi. And yame. 
All right, shake that off. Okay. So there's a couple reasons I added that pole in there. Is that after you grab them, it pulls them a little bit off balance and doesn't allow them to focus on your counter strikes, whether they be the punches or the kicks. All right. Two, for those of you that have been working on Saiyan with me last week, all right. All right, here's the grab and the pull. Okay, the same motion. So we're helping you with your self-defense. We're helping you with the kata. Okay. All right. So now we're going to do the full beginner self-defense. We'll start off with um, chest punch. So we're stepping to the side. Inside block, grab, pull, punch. Okay. Let's do five left and then five right. Okay. So on my count, I want to see you do the whole thing. I'm going to do the first couple with you, and then I'm going to watch you. Okay. All right. Going to your left first. So it's step left, block right. Stomach punch. Each. Okay. And knee. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to keep counting and you're going to keep doing it. Son. Cheat. Go. Good. All right. Let's go to step to our right and block left now. Okay. Five of them. Each. Knee. Son. Go. Okay. Good. Shake that off. Okay. Another benefit of pulling them after you grab them is it's kind of making you chamber this hand and helping that punch come out. All right. All right. Let's move on to face block. All right. Five left, five right. Remember, block, grab, pull. Punch, punch. All right. Here we go. Step left, block right. Each. Okay. Knee. side so we're going to step right block left grab pull punch punch all right here we go to the right each knee time cheat Go. Okay, all right, shake that off. All right, groin block. All right, let's make sure that we're grabbing. All right, and we, after we make that block, if they get used to it, point the palm forward. All right, for some reason, people have a hard time getting used to this grab. All right, 
they block and they try grabbing like this or they try reaching over okay just get them to turn the palm forward and the hand will fall right into that all right five left all right step left block right each Neat. Swan. Chi. Go. Okay. Good. All right. Step right, block left. All right, here we go. And each. Knee. Tongue. Cheek. Go. All right, very good. All right, now we're gonna spend a little bit of time working on our one-step self-defense against the haymaker or roundhouse punch. Now this doesn't show up on a test until black belt, but I'm not sure why we're not teaching it sooner. This is a very easy one to learn, at least the block part, okay? If you can see my lines on the floor, all right, I'm facing 12 o'clock. Well, imagine that they're doing their haymaker with their right. Okay, so in this case, they're coming from this side. I want to turn and step into that at this 45. The arms come up like this, okay? Key things here. One, don't have the arms face, don't have the palms facing in, okay? Your arms give too easily, all right? Make the palms face each other. You can lock those arms. Two, don't extend them out like this. All right? If you extend them out like this, the, the arm hits, slides right down, you get hit anyways. Okay? They've got to come up like a wall. It doesn't matter where it hits in here. Okay? But you want to block it. And you need to step into it with force. All right? Boom! Okay? Get right into that forward stance. All right. All right. So let's do five of these to the left. All right. You turn it about a 45 and get those arms up there and lock them. Each. Knee. Son. Cheat. Go. All right, to the right, okay? Turning to the right at that 45 and get that block up. Each. Knee. Son. Chi. Go. Good. All right, next. We're gonna do the block again, so we're gonna step into the block. The inside hand comes down, hammer fist to the groin, okay? So it's block, hammer fist, and back up. All right? So I'm turning, blocking, hammer fist. When this comes back up, scoop it up, because remember, it's going on the outside of their arm, and slap the back of your other hand. So in this case, it's the right hand hammer fist, right hand slaps the back of the left. Okay? Right hand slaps the back of the left. You do that enough, you remember it, and you won't have to think about it at all. All right? Here we go. To the left. Each. Block. Hammer. Slap. Knee, block, hammer, slap. I want you to get faster each time. Ton, block, hammer, smack. Cheat. Go. Great. All right, 
to the right. So it's gonna be block, hammer, slap. Okay. Each block, hammer, slap. Knee, block, hammer, slap. Tongue, block, hammer, smack. Chi, block, hammer, smack. And go, block, hammer, smack. Great. So those of you who've done this before know that that sets you up for the figure four takedown on the arm. Okay, which is hard to work on without a partner. Okay, all right, we are almost out of time. Okay, for this class. All right, so what I want to do is go through our Sanjuni Kionwaza. So get in your horse stance, okay. hands in the power position. All right. Remember, start with your left first. I'll call them out. Face block. Upside block. Inside block. Groin block. Stomach punch. Hook punch. Shuto. Ridge hand, palm, back fist, upwards elbow, forward elbow, side elbow smash, downwards elbow. Low axe, high axe. Okay. All right. Let's do it again one more time. All right. Everybody's in horse stance. Face. Outside. Inside. Groin. Stomach. Hook, Shuto, Ridge Hand, Palm Heel, Back Fist, Upwards Elbow, Forward Elbow, Side Elbow Smash. Downward elbow, low axe, high axe, and finish. All right, we're going to get kicked off here in a second. We've got advanced class at 8. Um, if you hadn't had a chance yet, go to the virtual dojo uh, on YouTube and check out the challenge that I issued over the weekend. All right, just go to YouTube, go to the Jima Spotlight, and then look for the channels, and you'll see one for Virtual Dojo, and you should see my Easter challenge there, okay? Try it, and we'll see you at 8 o'clock, so feet together, hands at your sides, and bow. All right, see you at 8 o'clock. We hope you enjoyed this video. We want you to enjoy all of our videos. We hope that you learn from our instructional videos, are entertained by our demonstrations, and you celebrate our competition and tournaments. Please subscribe to our Golden Eagle Martial Arts channels. And after subscribing, ring the bell down below to make sure you receive notifications when we post new content. Some of our instructional videos are unlisted and can't be found on our channels. You can view those videos by becoming a member of our website, www.jimakarate.com. We look forward to more teaching and entertaining 
and hope that you will join us. Have a great day.